All right, boys and girls? Hey, yo. We're in London. Again. We're here to interview Heidevolk and also see Sellsword. Yeah, that's going to be awesome. Yeah. Um, old Corpse Road playing. I've heard a lot about them, but I've not seen them live before, so it's going to be good to check them out with a, you know, they'll be awesome or not. Who knows? We need to get some dinners, don't we? We need to go get to fill our beds. Food, food and beer. Looks out there's a pub right opposite the hotel. Look. It's like beautiful. Ooh, there's a pub. There's a pub. And there's the rest of Camden about as well to explore, so uh, beer o'clock, yeah? Beer o'clock. How's the UK tour going so far? Great, great. Yeah, yeah we had a good it's time. Fun. Yeah. Yeah. UK audiences, obviously, you're not singing in English. So how does a UK audience or an American one differ from when you're in the rest of Europe? Oh, um, actually, there's not not really much different. I mean, every country we play in, you know, there's not much countries who actually speak our language. Yeah. Uh, but then again, we always encounter people who just try phonetically to talk to just you know mimic what we do, and it's great to see that. I remember you showing York. Um, you literally started. Uh, you'd say the title of a song, and I remember the look and confusion of your faces uh, when there was silence. But then the first note of the song plays, and the crowd would go, and you were just like, oh, okay, fair enough. Yeah, yeah. Um, that was. You were down in York? Yeah, I was in New York, yeah. yeah. I was also, um, yeah, yeah. Uh, seen, uh, uh, when you played with Equilibrium as well, down the road. As well as so. yeah, yeah. That was a great show, by the way. That was awesome. This is a question everyone's asked us since they heard we were coming to interview. You're touring with Corp Clanny and Trollfest next year. Obviously, there's no dates been announced yet. Um, is there going to be a UK date at least on the European tour? Um, so far, we know not. Um, yeah, we don't know. No, no we don't know. Yeah. Every, Sorry. Every, <laughs> that's, that's why they're not announced yet. Yeah, yeah. Every, everyone's just thinking: Is there going to be a UK show? And then is there going? Is it just going to be London? And if everyone's sort of. Yeah, I, wish, I, know, I, I wish we knew. Uh, yeah. yeah, there's a lot of time that happens. Yeah, when there's a there's a tour through Europe, then there's only a London show. But you know, even though it would only maybe one show, we would definitely come back for doing another mini tour next year. So yeah, definitely. definitely see this guy. That'd be much appreciated. I think. People in the UK have been loving to see you for years, and it's great that you're doing a whole UK tour. It's fantastic. Well, yeah, that's, that's nice of Javis. Yeah, <laughs> great, yeah. I mean, 15 years we only managed to come to the UK for four times. Yeah. I mean, it always was crazy with our work schedules, and uh, uh, now we just said we got to do this. You know, and then now we doubled it this weekend, so we did four more gigs in one weekend. That's, that makes eight in 15 years, but still not enough, of course, so we'll be adding back next year. I played a few acoustic shows uh, and from footage I've seen on YouTube they're, they're really great, everyone seems to really like them. Is there going to be an acoustic album? Ooh. 
Um, um, also, we don't know yet. <laughs> is it something you'd like? Is it something you'd like to do? Uh, yes, 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 something yes. we would Most like to do. Yeah. yeah. We've, we've discussed it. So, but well, we're there, still there's there's some some talks and yeah. some ideas, but uh, nothing concrete, uh, nothing solid. I think it's safe to say that at one point there will be an acoustic album, but just when we cannot yeah. say. Yeah. That. Okay, I suppose it's the, the halfway between. Some people really love it, and other people think, oh, it's a sell-out acoustic album. And uh, I don't know if it's, but I, I think it worked I, I really well. I've not heard any negative reactions to it. Uh, it's it's uh, the, the fun thing is it. Uh, uh, Appeals to uh, a different audience as well, you know. There's uh, like when we played at the uh, at the castle. Uh, what was the name again? Uh, um, Don Donneburg. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we played at the castle, which was like a, uh, for t it was for setting for a TV show. Is but that the one that's on YouTube? Yeah, yeah, that, yeah. that's so the we'll one. Put a link in the description yeah, and it, yeah. it was like uh, small children and uh, mothers and grandmothers yeah. and like whole families, and they liked it and. Uh, yeah. Well, yeah. Well, the the funny thing is, if you say it's a sellout, actually, the first songs we ever wrote were like acoustic yeah. on, on a campfire site. Yeah, yeah. So then we were a sellout before we even started. <laughs> 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 The lightweights. The lightweight, uh, like drinking wise. Yes, yes, yeah, drinking wise. Ah, <laughs> uh, oh, that's a good one. Right. Storm. I yeah. think it would be Kevin. Kevin Storm. Yeah. Yeah. Anything, anything in particular? Let you say that. Any good stories about? Uh, no, he's not. Not just not much of a drinker or eater. Yeah. He's uh, he's literally uh, the he's, lightweight. Yeah, the lightweight. I yeah. suppose that's true. Okay, we've got a, a question from a viewer here. Um, they've asked your opinion on Dutch metal vocalist, uh, death metal vocalist Martin van. I don't know if that's Drunen or Drunen. Martin Drunen, yeah. Yeah. Um, he asked if you know them personally as a person. Uh, I met him once or twice, but I'm, to say that I know him, yeah. not really. No. Yeah. Uh, is, is, is he a great musician? Do you think like, uh, Well, he's, a, he's a, some kind of a legend in what he does. Yeah. You, do, he, he, you hear directly that it's him. It's, yeah. He has his own trademark or his own voice. So, yeah. yeah. And, well, he did some famous records. Yeah. So, yeah. I, w I would say so. Question in Dutch is: Can ze een doos croquetten meenemen voor mij? Um, I don't think it's. A, yeah, it's a, it's it's a. Uh, I'll translate it. Try to translate. Croquette is a kind of a, a deep fried uh, snack, uh, yeah. a meat snack. Sounds nice. It's. Uh, they are really nice. Uh, I, I wish we would have known uh, beforehand. Uh, we could have uh, brought a box. Actually, I'm not yeah, really yeah. sure we can get across the border. Actually, you know, the really, I don't know. <laughs> oh well, they're, they're they're deeply frozen. So yeah, that should not be a problem. Could be, I guess. Could be all right. Yeah. Anyway, we didn't. So. Yeah, no. I really want to Sorry, try one now. Bad. Maybe yeah. next time. I had no idea what the, what the question was. So yeah, <laughs> that's a bit. So uh, 
what's the plan? Obviously, you're going straight to Europe after this date here. Um, what's the plans after this tour, if any? Finishing the new record. Yeah. Yes. yes. Yep. That's yep. the first thing on the chart. Do we have a release date for that yet? Uh, uh, not, not exactly. Not an date, official actually. date, but uh, it, it's going to be like end October or yeah. November. It's going to be out. Yeah. Um, actually, it's not announced yet. But we're going to do a, a tour in the US. Um, and uh, there will be route November. Yeah. So is that, is that a headlining tour? Uh, no, it's a, no, we're uh, main support, I guess. Yeah. Um, I don't know if I'm allowed to say yeah, yet, okay, but uh, 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 the, the the lineup will be uh, uh, Trollfest and uh, us and um, uh, Corpus Clowny. Sweet. Yeah, so almost the same as the European yeah, yeah, run. No, that's a pretty lineup. Yeah. Thank you very much, guys. It's been great to have you on. Um, I can't wait for the gig. Um, yeah, we'll see, see you. Well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'll uh, see you at the merch stand. Okay, yes, cool. see you around. See you around. There, so. yeah. Fucking ox! Jesus fuck! Whoa! That, that's me on the right. Yeah, you can't go up this cliff. Bro, bro! Bye bye! Oh. No, this okay. is gonna end really yeah. bad, lad! I'm shitting tits! <laughs> right, cool, we're cool. So, Big Jam. Yo, yo. Let's let you get in focus. Oh, you're nice and blurry, it looks artistic. Let's give it a second. I'm gonna have to do this more professionally than they do like this, yeah. You're blurry as fuck. I wish there was a focus button on it. Oh, 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 oh,
There we go. Look at you in sharp crisp 1080p. <laughs> so, um, Cell Sword, Old Corpse Road, and Heidevolk. Yes. Fucking awesome show. Yeah. Quick merch run, quickly. Cell Sword shirt, Heidevolk shirt, <coughs> Old Corpse Road patch, Heidevolk patch, Cell Sword patch. How was the gig, Dan? The gig was fucking amazing. It was. Um, of course, we saw Cell Sword yeah. at Panel Fest Quest mm -hmm. uh, in Birmingham, and their set then was amazing. I would say this show yeah. was, for them, was even better. Um, sound was on point. Yep. I don't know how they managed to get such amazing sound out of the tiny PA. It was a very tiny PA. It was, it was a very tiny PA, so it was a very small It venue. was a small boom, yeah. But at the same time, it, it was fucking spot on. I fully appreciated that set. Mm. It was fucking amazing. It was great. Um, old Crops Road Balloon, kind of black metal -y, metal ish kind of thing. I caught the end of their set. Yeah. I was off talking to some people, making contact and whatnot, but yeah, yeah, that was fucking amazing. No, it was brilliant. Um, I will be listening to them again. Yeah. I say, the Old Corps Road have done a lot of shows around the UK and we've never seen them before, so it was it was good to have that chance to be able to see them and actually make a uh, opinion yes. based Sorry. on, on yeah. a live yeah. show. So it was really good to see them. I thought they were great. They were fucking so awesome, really good. mate, yeah. 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 Um, Heidi Volk. Yeah. What a fucking band. Yeah, it's fine. Anyway, you know. So they've said they're going to do a, another tour soon. They did because they're competing the Ravensing. They are. They compete the Ravensing. Obviously, awesome. they're touring with um, Cup Clay and Trollfest. That's a fucking amazing tour. Obviously, we don't know if there's a UK show yet. So if there fucking isn't, we're going to be fucking fucking wank. <laughs> we we say uh, wank. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. We Very well articulated there. Yeah. Yeah. That's awesome. We, we've had a few pairs. Yeah. We're going to be sat there fucking wanking on our own, going, why the fuck isn't there the tour in the UK? But hopefully there is a tour in the UK, so we'll be fine. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. They gave no no hints, did they? They didn't give any hints. No. Um, am I in the mirror? Yes, I am. Even, even, when, even when directly asked, yes. they gave very Well, it's because trouble. they don't know yet. That's basically it. Yeah, that's gone on for way too long. Yeah. Anyway, um, also we get to got, got to meet some fucking uh, great guys today. Um, <coughs> uh, Faith. Yep. Um, it's a grand name. Flaming Goth. Yep, that's the one. Go check her out. Oh, it smells fucking awesome. Uh, she is very, very, very underfollowed. Yep. Um, Darren. Yep. As well. Um, yeah, yeah. A ginger beard that is very fucking soon to rival mine. Definitely, yeah, yeah. Fucking awesome bloke. Yeah. Sam is a fucking we, we talk about me, me and him were chatting for a very long time. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. That was fucking awesome. Um, and this, was it Italian bloke? Oh, to be honest, I didn't catch his name. He, he, he pretty much just spent the entire night with us. Yeah, he pushed. He was the guy pushing me in the trolley. Yeah, he, he was yeah. pushing me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, big fucking shout outs to him. Definitely, yeah, yeah. All in all, a fucking awesome night. Woo! Yeah, yeah, great night. So Wait, be, we're quite drunk. We'll probably do this again in the morning, sober, so we can compare the drunk and sober down. With, you know. Fuckity bye. Fuckity bye. Morning. It's Monday. You've got that Monday feeling. We need to go get breakfast. Oh gosh, you know those mornings when you wake up retarded. A level of being sober to being really hungover, how hungover are you? I'm okay, mate. Yeah, actually, I'm pretty. I mean, we do. We had a lot of drinks last night. Um, there's still quite a few beers left. Um, but I think the 
chips helped. There's chips on the way back. We'll eat not, so yeah. I'm feeling pretty good. Um, I need to get a shower and let's go get breakfast. Breakfast? Yeah. And then we'll do a proper review of the gig. Not like shit. What drunk from we did last night? Yeah. I've no idea what it's like. We'll have to look at it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs>